Seven the day ahead, the victim of a 2005 sexual assault in Fairfax County is expected to face her suspected attacker for the first time. Jesse Matthew is the man accused in this assault, and if you remember, he is the same man charged with killing University of Virginia student Hannah Graham. Jeanette Reyes is live outside the Fairfax County Courthouse with more on what we can expect in the day ahead. Jeanette? Well, Atria, we can expect quite a bit here. The victim here, it's been nearly a decade since she was allegedly dragged into a park, uh, sexually assaulted and choked. Now, she will face her, her accused attacker for the first time today. She says that that person is 33-year-old Jesse Matthew, who is linked to this case via DNA. Matthew is facing a capital charge, capital murder charge in a separate case for the high-profile killing of University of Virginia student Hannah Graham. Today's hearing is a defense motion the purpose of it, to bar the victim from identifying Matthew in court as the man who sexually assaulted her. All of this before the trial begins on Monday. The defense says the victim's description of her attacker was vague. And the only reason she's been able to identify Matthew is because his picture was repeatedly shown on TV and elsewhere in connection to the Hannah Graham case. Now, this hearing is set to get underway at 3 o'clock this afternoon. And I should mention that Matthew's attorneys are also asking the judge to bar the media from entering the courtroom and covering this case inside of the courtroom because according to them it could taint the jury pool. We'll keep you posted on both of those points coming up later on this afternoon. Reporting live in Fairfax County, Jeanette Reyes, News Channel 8.